What's up guys, hope we're doing well. I'm Scooter Magruder and this is Magruder Mobile. And today we drove all the way to the University of Central Florida to find out more about the friend zone. Today I'm here with Michael, Kevin, Jordan, Natasha, I'm Morgan, Mitchell, Marissa, Bia. And we are talking about the friend zone. But before we get started on that, how do you like going to UCF? I love it. Best school in the nation. Parking is uh, pretty awful. Uh, so far, can't complain. It's pretty good. What do you like about being a UCF night? everything. It's a lot better than being a Florida Gator. Wow. I love it. Even though it's the biggest school, I think I fit right in and I love the people around here. I heard, you know, Gainesville is pretty boring. I got a full ride to UF and chose UCF over UF because I love the Stop. Games. Rate the girls. One being Rosie O'Donnell. I'll give the majority an eight. 9.266. Love average, I would say. How are the guys at UCF? The guys are good. Ten being Scooter Magruder, <laughs> one being Flavor Flav. What are the guys? Uh, I mean, nothing compares to you, so I have to give them a nine. If you could change one thing about UCF, what would it be, Natasha? Ooh, how much money it is. I'd pick it up and move it next to the beach. A lot of people commute here, and a okay. lot of people just go home after yeah. the weekend. So a lot of people don't? Yeah. On the weekends, it's like empty. It's like this. It's just and I've seen FSU and FSU has got it going on. Well, we party. I heard FSU is kind of nasty, so it's like a different kind of party. We're a classier kind of party. But Bia, the real reason we came here today is because we wanted to find out more about the friend zone. Friend zone. The friend zone. The friend zone. What is the friend zone? Friend zone is basically when a guy puts himself in a position where he becomes completely undateable. You're interested in a girl and you're like, wow, I really like her. Where you put a guy you are not interested in. And all of a sudden you're talking to her and she just drops, oh yeah, I have a boyfriend. Friend zone's a black hole that you cannot get out of. You sound like you've been there before. I have not been in the friend zone, but I've witnessed it. Oh my God, you're like a big brother to me. You're just stuck in that zone of just, you're just a friend to me. Now, Doug, can I call you Doug? You can call me Doug. What is the friend zone? I don't know. Have you been friend zoned before? Once in high school. I would say so. There's like this one girl I was interested in and uh, of course I got the infamous, oh, you're such a great friend. Tell us about this experience. What happened? You seem a little bit broken up about it. What What happened? I was too much of a friend to her, like our best friend and everything. She, so like you watched The Notebook is what you're saying? No, we did not actually watch it. How many times did you watch The Notebook with her? Maybe once. How many guys have you put into the friend zone? Do not lie, Natasha. <laughs> Um, I've had my few. I've had to impose the friend zone on a guy, but usually, you know, a guy will do it to himself. Honestly, not because I've been with this guy for three years, so... Three years? Yeah. <laughs> now, did you, did he start off in the friend zone? Well, yeah, obviously, because, like, you don't know each other that much. Obviously. Well, you, no, at first oh, you're friends. Let's say you put a guy in the friend zone. How does he get out of the friend zone? Is it even possible, Bia? Um, yeah, of course it is. I don't really think there is a way to get out of it. Man up man up and just talk to her and be like, this is not where I want to be. They say that the best relationships go from friendships, so... It's not. It's, it's not, not possible. possible. I've never seen that. <laughs> Take me out to a really nice date and let me know that you want to get out of the zone, because maybe I don't know. If you're the shoulder to cry on, I'm not going to want to sleep with you. You can always go through a massive like hoax of how you died and then you come back to life and then she realizes that she truly really does have feelings for you. Okay, so what you're saying, you're suggesting a catfish situation, Manti Teo-esque. Yes. Thought a name. Gladivet. All right, so you say Gladivet? Gladivet, I know we're really good friends, and I have feelings for you that's more than just friends, and I like to take it to another level. There's always a way to get out of the friend zone. How, do you know anyone who's gotten out of the friend zone? No. What is it like being a redhead? Um, being a redhead's great. Thank you for calling a redhead not a ginger, by the way. I appreciate that. There's I, a distinction. There, there is a distinction. <laughs> Gingers do not have souls. Did you hear that? That means you've been chosen to represent your university in the academic challenge. What state or states border Florida? Louisiana, uh, Mississippi, uh, Alabama, and Georgia. Are you single? I am single. Who was the second president of the United States of America. I want to say John Adams, but I don't know. In H2O, what does the two stand for? One component of oxygen and two components of hydrogen. What is the absolute value of nine? Absolute value of three? Which team won the Super Bowl in 2011? Patriots. That's all the time we have for today. As always, subscribe if you're new, and don't forget, press the like button. New videos every Sunday. No, jugamos juegos. Dummy Dally. Go night. Go night. <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs>